Good morning, friends. Um, I'm really sorry. I know the last two vlogs have really been nothing, just me checking in. Um, I have come here. Stop crying. I have been in such a funk this week. Like, I've just been really sad. Um, I don't know. I knew it was going to be a hard week. I did because Father's Day and then tomorrow, which is Friday, makes a year that my dog of 15 years passed away. He was 17 when he passed away. I knew it was going to be a rough week, but I didn't think I was it was going to be this bad. Like, I literally have not wanted to do anything. It has... Hey, knock it off, dirty boy. He's licking the countertop. Um, it's been hard just getting up and going every day. I've literally just wanted to stay in bed and do nothing. But I pushed myself and I woke up at 4 this morning and just started crying uncontrollably sobbing and I couldn't stop and I really have no reason. I mean, I'm blessed. I, you know, I have a, a good life and I don't know. I just bawled and bawled and bawled and bawled and then fell back to sleep for two and a half hours and I woke up feeling better. So I guess, you know, sometimes it's just what you need to do is just to cry and let it out. So, um, it's just hard because I feel bad when I get like this because I almost feel like I'm being ungrateful and my life may not be what I want it to be but I have a good life and I'm very blessed and I'm thankful very thankful for what I do have and what the good Lord has done for me and I just hate feeling that way because when I'm I'm depressed like that I feel you know like I'm being ungrateful. I'm not, I'm not in any ways being ungrateful. It's just a matter of having bad days and it just makes me feel bad that I feel that way because there's like sick people out there and you know people that are in like real pain and here I am like feeling depressed and you know don't really have like the best reason to be feeling that way so I do feel a lot better today um I got a hold of the maintenance guy again and he apologized told me he forgot if he can come over tomorrow so I have a doctor's appointment tomorrow morning and I'm gonna be um pet sitting Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So, um, for a friend. On top of pet sitting for my mom, too. Um, my friend's is going to be easy. I'm just going to his house and taking care of his animals a couple times a day and coming home. But, um, so I'm going to, like, get my butt in gear today. Um, I feel it's pointless to clean up down here, downstairs, because if he's going to come look at the sink tomorrow. I mean, I still have all of this sitting here. So, <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and clean upstairs. And I'm waiting for my mom because she got that movie from Redbox and doesn't know how to take it back. So, I'm going to go with her to return it. I think that's his problem, is he thinks I'm leaving right now. Hey, hey, don't take my hair tie. I'm not going anywhere right now. Oh, this little guy. I'm not going anywhere, Dingo. 
so I'm gonna start getting cleaning upstairs I didn't put any makeup on sorry I know I haven't put makeup on all week but um I'm gonna go clean upstairs and I want to take out the um, air filter and go ahead and clean that too for the AC God bless you so and then I've got a ton of editing I need to do so I've got a lot to keep me busy I've had a lot to keep me busy all week but I've just not felt like doing anything Hello friends, so I didn't get the vacuuming done as soon as I got upstairs um, and switched over laundry my mom came over I had to go with her to return that movie to Redbox and then we had lunch and watched the season finale of The Good Witch so my mom just left and Tina's down for her nap but I don't want to run the vacuum while Tina's sleeping, but I'm going to go ahead and go dust my room and clean the upstairs bathroom. I'm thinking I should probably get a video edited too. Yeah, I think I'll do that. I'll get a video started and then clean my room. Okay, so I got the upstairs bathroom cleaned, and I'm on my second video, um, publishing. So, <laughs> ugh, my dog, man, he shed so bad during the summer. So, I have no linen closet in my townhouse. There's, like, nowhere to put the blanket, sheets, towels, nothing. So, it's kind of funny. So, what I do is I've kept... Three of my comforters that I go back and forth between and I roll them up like a sleeping bag and tie them and then <laughs> I set them in the bottom of my closet like that so I changed into my Tinkerbell bedding and there's a little peanut so I rolled that one up to put away we do a little peanut he sits like a little girl with his paws crossed. My little peanut sits like a little girl. Yeah, so dainty. <laughs> Are you dainty? You dainty, delicate little flower that turns into a vicious monster. Yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and dust my bedroom. He's such a good boy. He knows I'm cleaning and he's trying to stay out of the way. <laughs> so much for that. <laughs> you almost didn't make that jump. No, you almost didn't make it. Okay, so today has not gone <laughs> exactly how I planned it to be. My mom came here and needed me to help her with more stuff, so I went with her to help her. I just made dinner, but I'm really proud of myself because look at this. I cleaned up the dishes already, so all I have to do is rinse our plates and put them in the dishwasher. And I'm done for the night with all of that. Alright, we'll check in with you later.